Hi folks, um, it's been a bit frustrating doing this one I'm afraid. We've had the usual techie, well I've had the usual techie problems. Um, I'm hoping that this will work because otherwise I might stop doing it altogether. Right, let's have a look. Um, okay, Naira, you posted to Lynn about not doing something. Um, what I'm not doing today is being very patient. This computer stuff really drives me insane when it doesn't work. So Naira, let's see what you weren't doing. Hi teacher, I am not cooking. I am studying English with you. Thank you and bye. And Lynn says, hello again Naira. Good post, well done. Here's a small correction. Hi teacher, I am not cooking. I am studying English with you. Thank you and bye. And Eduardo. Oh, Eduardo, I have... This post reminded me of when I was at school and I was probably about 12 or 13 in a maths class and we were doing some stuff off the, off the blackboard and I was concentrating really hard and I ended up at the end of the lesson being told to write out 100 times I must not sing in class because apparently I was humming as I was working so it's um it's a very poignant post Eduardo <laughs> anyway you said uh, hello teacher I'm not singing a song I'm studying English bye and Lynn replied hello Eduardo welcome to the network Singing and learning, you can do both, you know. Well, Lynn, I wish my teacher had understood that. <laughs> Here's your correction. Hello, teacher. I'm not singing a song. I'm studying English. Bye. And Dinosauro. What a wonderful name. Hi, teacher. I'm not listening to music of the lesson eight. It's an old song. And Lynn says, hi, Dino. It's a str it's strange hearing a dinosaur say that something is old. Ha ha, very funny, Lynn. Here's your correction. Hi, teacher. I'm not listening to the music from Lesson 8 because it's an old song. Sometimes, Dino, the oldies are the goodies. And Beeritz. Oh, Beatrice, sorry. not Beeritz is a place, isn't it? Hello, teacher. I'm not studying Spanish. I'm studying English. Bye. Here's a small correction, says Lynn. Hello, Beatrice. Hello, teacher. I'm not studying Spanish. I'm studying English. Bye. And if you notice, Beatrice, um, both Spanish and English should have a capital letter um, because they are, what are they called? Proper nouns, that's it. <laughs> and Alex, let's have a look what you said. Hello, teacher. I'm not playing with my dog. Also, I'm not watching TV. All that I'm doing now is learning English with you. And Lynn says, hi, Alex. Good post. Well done. And she corrects you, I think, with some full stops, if you notice. Otherwise, it was rather a long sentence to read all in one breath. Hello, teacher. I'm not playing with my dog and I'm not watching TV either. All that I'm doing now is learning English with you. The Eister, I don't know if that's how you pronounce your name, I hope it is. Hello teacher, I'm not dancing, I'm singing. I'm not eating chocolate and candies, I'm eating fruits and vegetables. I'm not doing homework, I'm reading a book. Please correct my sentences, have a nice evening. And Lynn says, hi Eister, welcome to the network, lovely post, well done. Here's your first correction. Hello teacher, I'm not dancing, I'm singing. I'm not eating chocolate and candies, I'm eating fruit and vegetables. I'm not doing my homework, I'm reading a book. Please correct my sentences. Have a nice evening. Not much to correct there, Eister, well done. And Lynn says note that candies is an American English word. In England and Britain we would say sweets. Okay, Oddie. Hi, teacher. 
I'm not listening radio, but I am watching television and I'm learning English. Thank you. Oh, it's not Oddy. Sorry, it's Roddy. I've missed an R off on the um, on the copy. So, Roddy, Lynn says, good post. Well done. Here's your correction. Hi, teacher. I'm not listening to the radio, but I am watching television and I am learning English. Thank you. Uh, JG or JJ, um, she sa he says, hi teacher, I'm not singing, I'm writing, I'm not eating, I'm thinking, I'm not sleeping, but I'm dreaming, that I'm speaking, writing, reading a very good English every day. Good night and sweet dreams. <laughs> and Lynn says, hi Jay, good post, well done, thanks for the smile. Here's a small correction. Hi teacher, I'm not singing, I'm writing. I'm not eating, I'm thinking. I'm not sleep sleeping, but I am dreaming that soon I will be speaking, writing and reading very good English every day. Good night and sweet dreams. Well actually Jay, I think that's more like a poem. I think that's brilliant, well done. So Helvio says, hi Lynn. I am not sighting on a chair and I'm not typing this letters. In fact, I am becoming a liar. See you, te see you teacher. And Lynn says, hi, Helvio. Thanks for the giggle. I like a giggle too. It was very funny. Hi, Lynn. I'm not sit And Lynn's put sighting as well. Dear, oh dear. Should be a double T in there, Helvio. I'm not sitting on a chair and I'm not typing these letters. In fact, I am becoming a liar. And Helvio nicely replied again. Thank you. I am copying these and liar, hoping you should have had an I there, Helvio. I don't forget them any more. Another giggle to you. You did indeed. But you need to add sitting, not citing to your list as well, Helvio. And Marcia, uh, hi teacher, I am not listening to music, I am studying English and I am listening the television. P.S. I want to write my comments using the contracted form, but I don't find the apostrophe on the keyboard of my computer. Thanks for your help. So good job Lynn knows these things, Marcia, because I wouldn't have a clue. Uh, anyway, she says, hi Marcia, good post, well done, here's your correction. Hi, teacher. I am not listening to music. I am studying English and listening to the television. P.S. I want to write my comments using the contracted form, but I can't find the apostrophe on the keyboard of my computer. And Lynn says, oh dear, now that's an issue. You could try cutting and pasting one into a document. I do that with the pound symbol, which isn't on my keyboard. Just keep it ready on notepad. I hope you know what notepad is, Marcia, because I don't. OK, folks, so there we go. Lesson eight. And hopefully it won't take me so long to do lesson nine. Have a good day. Bye bye.